recent allegation claims that Vogue has replaced Meghan Markle with a trailblazing black marchness. Emma Weimer's meager million-dollar agreement when she hit the red carpet at the Vogue party, Emma Weymouth, gorgeous in a shimmering silver costume, stole the stage. Emma was brought up in aristocratic circles even though she had a socialite mother from Britain and a billionaire Nigerian father to support the upkeep of the estate, her family even successfully converted it into an animal safari business. Emma is more alluring than simply being stunningly gorgeous, she's also a talented writer. She is not just a celebrity icon, but she also regularly writes her own articles and has even modeled for prestigious fashion publications with celebrities like Stevie Wonder. Emma was advocating a different perspective at a time when Meghan Markle regularly exploited her ethnicity as a bulwark in her conflicts with the British royal family. In sharp contrast to the divided rhetoric, Emma advocated in defense of authentic feminism, claiming that feminist women do not utilize their ethnicity as a means of popularity or to disparage other cultures. Emma shared their hopes for a day in the future when her skin tone wouldn't be an identifying trait. Her responsibilities as a wife, mother, and caretaker of the magnificent Longleat estate were highlighted. With the new million-dollar contract Emma recently signed with Vogue, a number of intriguing ideas are now possible. As the first Black March nurse in British history, this historic cooperation confirms her aspirations for the future. One of their goals is to conduct fashion events at Longleat, merging the world of luxury fashion with the family's opulent estate. Emma chose a stunning metallic dress with a bustier top and a flowing silk skirt with a sparkling sequin bodice to wear to the Vogue World London 2023 event during London Fashion Week. She completed her ensemble with silver pumps, a matching sequin bag, and priceless diamond jewellery. Princesses Eugenie and Beatrice also attended the star-studded Vogue event. The pair resides in the opulent, historically significant Longley estate. In the meantime, speaking of our Duchess Meghan's relationship with Vogue, rumor has it that Anna Wintour ensures Meghan won't ever get a Vogue cover or an invitation to the Met Gala. This comes after Meghan spoke with Vogue magazine last year about the United States Supreme Court's decision to strike down the right to abortion, the former American changed her name to Duchess of Sussex when she reposted the article. The magazine subsequently reportedly edited its Instagram post to replace Meghan's name with the royal title adopting Tumblr, and an anonymous source claimed that my neighbor's sister-in-law works at Vogue. They were all inconsolable laughing at the text they received for the name change from Markle to Sussex apparently they were going to leave it but Yellen persuaded Anna Wintour and Anna Winter agreed to the name change but said something to the effect of, and that's why she'll the royalist Anna Wintour supposedly despises Meghan Markle. No one wants Lily or Archie on the cover, instead, everyone wants Charlotte for future issues of British Vogue, and Anna wants Catherine back, according to a different source.